latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Kevin Holmes with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines for Monday, November 23rd. Miami County will now mandate wearing masks in public indoor places. This afternoon, the county's commission voted to adopt Governor Laura Kelly's executive order, which takes effect Wednesday. If you're currently getting extended unemployment in Kansas, your last payment could be just weeks away. The U.S. Department of Labor ending the extended benefits unemployment program in the state. The last payable week ends on December 12th. The decision will also end any extra payments, even if you have a remaining balance. The Kansas Department of Labor will get in touch with everyone impacted, and if you still need help, you may be eligible for the Pandemic Unemployment Assistance, or PUA. The CDC recommends no travel this holiday season, but some are choosing to take a trip to see loved ones despite that warning. The airport says between November 20th and December 1st last year, there were 400,000 passengers in and out of KCI, and this year they're estimating about 180,000 passengers will pass through the airport. That's down 55%. That also takes into account airlines that are blocking seats. Right now, Delta and Southwest are leaving middle seats open. Delta says it will leave middle seats open until March. Southwest will start filling them in December. Gary Lezak next in line for takeoff with the forecast. I am taking off, no doubt about it. Uh, let's go. I actually need to land and get to sleep. We do have a storm that will be developing on Tuesday and Tuesday night, spreading rain and thunderstorms our way. A possibility of a little lightning and thunder, actually, and then a wind shift to the northwest on Wednesday with a little bit of light rain. The forecast tonight. We rise, we rise up to 42 degrees at 6 o'clock in the morning, 52 in the afternoon with a chance of rain and thunderstorms at nearly 100%. Not all day, though. 58 on Thanksgiving Day. Yes. Remember to get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.